Hello everyone. Today we are going to learn the failing test for aldehyde and ketone. What is aldehyde? The compound which has CH group is called aldehyde and the compound which has carbonyl group sorry carbonyl group is called ketone well so today we'll look at the difference between aldehyde and ketone by failing test well what is failing reagent or failing solution right apostrophe s so failing solution is a blue solution right and in this solution you will get copper hydroxide sodium hydroxide potassium di this is di tartarato this is di tartarato q freight right this is q freight this is potassium di di tartarato q freight right here this is the oxidation state of copper so you see that the two here the two minus will come from this ion that is that is di tartarato uh, ion so we get this di tartarato ion from tartaric acid this is the formula of tartaric acid you see that one two three four these two carbon has a which is which is but the n carbon has carboxylic acid group if you deduct a hydrogen uh, from this carboxylic group and this group you will get tartarato ion right this is tartarato ion well so this ion here there is two di uh, two uh, tartarato ion right here so you are getting potassium di tartarato cube right right so in the failing solution the copper right what is the oxidation state of copper here the oxidation state of copper is 2 plus right 2 plus well this 2 plus copper ion is act as an oxidizing agent right so now we'll see the reaction between aldehyde and failing solution this is aldehyde this is ethanol and if you add here failing solution then the copper 2 plus ion which will come from failing solution will react with aldehyde that is ethanol this is ethanol ethanol right and you will get this this compound at first which is cuprous oxide the red precipitation of cuprous oxide right so the oxidation state of copper here one plus right but here two plus so this is this copper hydroxide is oxidizing agent and this is uh, this LDH is a reducing agent right this is reducing agent reducing reducing agent so this is oxid oxidizing agent this is reducing agent a reducing agent will be oxidized to sodium ethanoate and oxidizing agent will be reduced to cuprous oxide the color of cuprous oxide is red which is the proof of the presence of aldehyde in the solution right 
so by the presence of this cuprous oxide you can tell that uh, in this solution aldehyde is aldehyde uh, aldehyde is present well now we will look at the reaction between fueling solution and ketone well you see here fueling solution means uh, copper hydroxide and sodium oxide if you add fueling solution to propanone this is propanone then no reaction will happen right that is the color of the solution will not change thus you can tell that here ketone is present ketone, ketone is present that is ketones never give failing failing solution test i hope this lecture is helpful for you thank you for viewing this video be well